pass. More controversy today as another study released raised questions about the need for regular mammograms. Medical reporter Liz Bonas spent the day talking with health care providers about this report, and she joins us with more. Please explain, Liz. Oh, quite a bit of controversy. Thank you very much, Kit. The study released in the British Medical Journal is a review of 90,000 women between the ages of 40 and 59. Researchers found that over 25 years, the same number of women died of breast cancer, regardless of whether or not they had a mammogram each year or not. Now, we stopped out at St. Elizabeth Healthcare in Fort Thomas today to talk to healthcare providers there as well as Dr. Jackie Sweeney. She is a radiologist who says it is important for women to know that this is one study and several others dispute these findings. I think we have plenty of studies that have shown a reduction in mortality and morbidity in patients who get yearly screening mammography. It is not a perfect test. We know the limitations, but I think our patients have to understand that their best offense to find early stage treatable curable breast cancer is to have a yearly mammogram, check their breasts monthly, know them better than anybody else. Now one other concern in this study was also that researchers said about one in five tumors found are not considered life-threatening so finding them early does not save lives. But we do have a local woman who says she has no doubt a mammogram helped save her life. We will hear more from her and the team at St. Elizabeth Healthcare on Local 12 News at 530. Kit. Thanks, Liz.